So this is going to be a reading for my Sagittarius. Thank you so much for joining me. We're going to go ahead and get straight into it. Keep in mind with this being a 40 hour forecast and being general, only take what does apply to you and let the rest fly. And the time frames, it can literally go beyond this time frame or some of these things may have happened prior to this time frame. But um, if you are in need of more so of a personal reading, check out the information below. Subscribe, hit that notification bell if you want to see more of our readings. And let's see what's going on, Sagittarius. Now, first thing I want to kind of talk about um, energy-wise for you guys, I get the sense of you guys needing to, for one, stay focused, okay? Distractions, feeling sorry for yourself, all of that stuff is not going to help you when it comes to certain goals that you have in mind, certain things that you're trying to achieve, Okay, you guys need to stay focused. You guys need to stay determined, especially when it comes to like a weight loss goal, a financial goal, um, a business goal that you're trying to achieve here. Um, a lot of you also really do need to work on the defensiveness. Um, this could be defensiveness in just letting people in general get close to you because you may have had experiences where you let people get close to you and they may have screwed you over. This doesn't mean because you may have gotten screwed over in the past that you completely allow yourself to, you know, be disconnected from people or not build meaningful connections with people, but more so being cautious of the people you build those connections with so you don't run into that issue. Okay. Hmm. Also during this time frame, you may have someone who's like just really prideful an egotistical or acting prideful and egotistical that could be of um that could be an obstacle to you in this time frame but moving more into the reading the first card is going to represent you and your present situation and with the six of wands again this is you guys wanting success wanting more for yourself career-wise a lot of you have had successful moments throughout the year and you've successfully done things, accomplish things, but you don't feel like you're hundred percent in the energy of accomplishing. For some of you, this is mainly because you're beating yourself up and you're overthinking things. But some of you, it's mainly like you just haven't been giving it all you've got. And you know, you could be giving more energy, more to whatever, um, like you do creatively or business wise or within your career. Um, you could also be either wanting someone's attention or someone could be desperately wanting your attention, especially if they see you doing good after you guys may have broken up here. Okay. Um, some of you may have like multiple options romantically, and you could be also contemplating during this time frame which option is the better one. Especially if both of them are more um, inconsistent. So this is like you guys dating today, going on dates today, not talking tomorrow. Like you could be dealing with just inconsistent situations like that. Or you're questioning why your current relationship may be so up and down, high highs, low lows, too consistently. Now, when it comes to the next card, this is going to represent what actions you can take during this time frame to make the most out of this time frame. So with the Ace of Materials or Ace of Pentacles in reverse, this is not offering someone another opportunity to get back into a relationship if you know that they're just going to play around with your heart, okay? Um, Page of Pentacles, if you're dealing with somebody who doesn't have the same intentions that you do, like marriage, children, or a serious connection, then giving energy to someone who just wants to be friends with benefits or just doesn't have real plans for this connection is a disaster waiting to happen. Some of you need to explore your other financial opportunities, especially if you feel like you're not being supported enough and you have more things that you want to do financially. Now, when it comes to the challenge or obstacle that may come up, I do have the five of pentacles in reverse. So the issue may be 
Hmm. Reconciling with someone and it being more favorable in energy. That could be the uh, first challenge. Some of you have like made a weight loss goal, but you could be like putting more weight back on because your eating habits may be unstable or like you don't have time to meal prep or like stay on top of your diet like how you would like to or in the beginning of your diet, I should say. Some of you can't help but to let someone back into your life and to communicate with them. No matter how much you try to get away from this person, for some reason, it's either like a piece of you feels connected to them and you always go back to the connection or like they show up and then you can't say no. So it, it's interesting. Now, when it comes to what I see for the future, with the moon card in reverse, someone's true intentions or motives are going to be exposed. You're also going to no longer be in this space of like confusion and feeling like you're in the dark with a certain situation. Um, what may happen is things are kind of put on the table in terms of like a romantic interest that you have in, in what they have going on, especially if you suspect that they may still be connected to an ex or someone they have like a friends with benefits situation with. Um, also, if you were like in this constant state of like fear, anxiety, worry in terms of the future, a lot of you are going to come out of that space after you realize that you have full control over how things manifest or play out in the future. But the last card this is going to represent what you may have been avoiding for some time frame that you will have to face during this time frame. And with the three of wands. This is how your actions kind of affect your future, what you give attention to, how that affects your future. And a lot of you do need to look at that. Um, life is more so of cause and effect. OK, what you do today I guarantee you it will be a running theme in terms of how things play out in the future. And a lot of you need to look at that. And that will help you, that will motivate you to take the steps now to change your, change your future overall. So this is what I see. I hope I did put things in perspective. If you did enjoy, feel free to thumbs the video up and subscribe. Check out the information listed below as well to book a session and I will see each and every one of you in the next one. Bye Sagittarius.